previously on A-Listers. Because guess what? This is your next group challenge. We have 30 minutes to rally the crowd behind us. The crowd has to come over here, taste your cocktail. If they like it, they will vote. Sounds like a fair game? Sounds like a fair game to me. I think so too. So cheers everyone, your time starts now. Not too strong and not too sweet. It's just perfect. Yellow is the best. A little sour and fruity. Gentlemen, this is the moment that we've all been waiting for. We have Alexis with us as well, brand manager of Shivas. This is the absolute ultimate taste test for you. What did you think of that? Very refreshing. Yep. Uh, this is the ginger snap, I believe. I think you need a bit more Shivas. A bit more Shivas. How am I not surprised? Darren, what did you think of it? I concur, it needs a little bit more kick and the watermelon's a bit too much. So maybe a bit more ginger will actually be nice as well. Nice. Gentlemen, the Ottoman was given a name all the way from Turkey. Yes. Alexis. Okay, um, I like the spices uh, and I love the name. You like the name, huh? Yeah. Is that something that you would serve in a bar? Yes. This is called chili sour. It's got nice chili flavors in there. Good pineapple, uh, but a tad bit too sour. Okay. There isn't a good balance to it. All right, this is the tropical mojito. Mm. Alexis, what do you think? Oh, nice. Like that? Yes, especially uh, under the hot sun. Okay, I love it because of the pineapple and I think there are some herbs inside. Mint. Mm. Mint, right? Yeah, the mint. Yeah. The mint is nice. Well, we've tasted all the cocktails, guys, correct? Yes. And there can only be one winner, but I think that you all did such a fantastic job. You really deserve a round of applause. I think if you're standing outside on a beach and you just tell people there are free cocktails, they are going to come. But people have voted. The public has definitely spoken. Darren? Well, I think uh, they're very, actually two very close results. Ginger Snap and the Chili Sour, they were both very, very popular. We have a winner though, we've got to pick a winner today. Well, the, the, the final winner definitely is uh, the Ginger Snap. <laughs> well done, guys. Each of you is rewarded with a fine bottle of scotch. 18 years old, you got to really enjoy this. You can share it with the rest of your friends. We had a master mixer out right here. We had a fantastic concept design artist out there. Yeah, and, and we have the uh, master of everything. I was just watching. Guys, it is the sunset on this fabulous beach. It's time for dinner, time to relax. And in case you thought that you were going to get eliminated tonight, you're not. But that doesn't mean that you're not going to get eliminated tomorrow. So have an awesome evening, and we'll see you at the next challenge. Who do you think is playing the game? Um, I'd rather not name any names. 
a few a few of the guys are my favorites, but um, I wouldn't see any anybody so far like like really would stand out of it. Besides me, of course. The, the, the weakest in the competition for me it's uh, it's Maxim since I have the feeling that maybe it's not completely expressing himself. Then definitely this is a game in which you're gonna lose if you're just like faking something. Uh, if I was to really really choose one, I'd probably say um, probably Chris because he's very uh, calm and he's nonchalant about this. Chris was actually the one playing the game. He sounds like too good a guy to be, you know, to be true. I'm letting my nerves get the better of me. I'm a little bit disappointed with myself, actually. Sir Tash is definitely playing the game. From the moment we walked in, he is loud. I mean, don't get me wrong, I think he's naturally a loud character. Is there an alliance forming? Well, I think there's a few. There are people that I can't remember their names. I think that's an indication of they're not really like putting their A games. I think everyone's in there to win it. We're down to the last 12 out of 30, so I think everyone's strong who's in the competition at the moment. I'll try to poison a few of them, but we'll see how it goes. Tune in to the next webisode to find out who makes the cut and who might be checking out of the competition. The top three A-listers will each receive a Tag Heuer Carrera, a bottle of Chivas Regal 18, one month's usage of the Citroen DS4, a CK Calvin Klein wardrobe, a Canon PowerShot G1X, and Lab Series Grooming Essentials. And here's the power shot of the day. Log on to augustman.com slash A-listers now to vote for your favorite A-lister. Voting ends 30th September.